What's good guys? I am here at my house right now as you can see. I haven't started all my videos in my room lately. We haven't been starting in parking lots, you know? I'm kind of liking it a little bit. I'm not going to lie. But um, I have, I'm waiting for a package right now for my car. I ordered another car part. This one's not like super major. It's not like making my car fast or anything. Well, I mean, if you want to play games, then it's added five horsepower because it's, it just looks cool. But um, all my social media is going to be in the description, guys. Um, I'm waiting for this car part right now. I don't know what I have planned for today, but I figured I might as well pick up the camera, film a little bit, see what goes down for today, and just get a video out for you guys. So I'm going to try and not slack off on today, and I'm going to try and make this video as best as I can. And just hopefully today turns out pretty good, and we have some interesting stuff to film. But I'll definitely film me putting on that car part. And I also did something to my tires, which I'll go show you guys right now before... The ups guy gets here because i'm still waiting as you can see on my package but i'll go show you guys i did i put tire lettering on the car like you know the marker so i did that and it looks pretty good well i like it at least you guys let me know what you think this man's just playing fortnite mobile right now oh. Ah. oh perfect the sun just came out right when i wanted to film too but yeah guys we added some some whoa it looks the car looks really cool right here just the hood looks, it's like different colors. But yeah, we added some tire lettering as you can see. If you can see. I'll put a video of, of me at night. I was driving like a few days ago when me and Connor did it and it, the video came out pretty dope. So I'll play that right now. This is how it came out as you can see. It came out pretty good. And then I ordered something for the windows. I didn't order nothing for the back window but i was sent for the side window so if you guys know about cars you probably already know what it is and a lot of mustangs have it but you'll see when it gets here and hopefully it gets here soon because i don't feel like waiting any longer but we'll see what happens hi brutus right here yeah guys i forgot to tell you guys one thing I, I don't think i told you guys about this yet but i got a lot of comments for my exhaust so i ended up ordering an x pipe which is in my trunk right now so i got an x pipe i just got to get it put on which is kind of hard to do because I went to a place yesterday they told me $250 when I know it's like $80 to put it on because I only have to weld one side and the other side's clamped so they're, they're, they're trying to rob me but I'll make it happen. This is the pipe. It deletes your resonators and then you put this pipe there instead and then it's going to make my car really loud so yeah. It should be good. Alright so you know I got tired of waiting. I went on a little hunt for the UPS man and I found his ass. So we got the package right here. Um, we're going to get opened up and stuff. I'm going to just go to the bathroom real quick and then we'll go from there. And I just heard a big noise outside and I hope nobody hit my car because that won't make me too happy. We're good. Right, I'm not liking this angle already. Hold up. Fair warning, guys. Um, I literally paid close to nothing for these. So if they're not like super high quality or name brand, I really don't care. It's a piece of plastic either way. But um, it's all good. So let's, let's open these up. I think I need to get some stuff in the engine because, you know, I've just been working on the outside and the outside looks pretty good right now, in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. But, um, yeah, I think it's some time for some engine modifications. We need to make this car faster for sure. I'm opening this up right now. Let's see what we got. Oh, thank God. It came with 3M tape. We're good. Let's go. All right. So if you guys didn't know what I got, they're called louvers or I don't, I don't know what they're called for the sides. I'm pretty sure it's still a louver. But... This is what it looks like. It's, it's just a piece of plastic. Yeah, that's that's about it. So I'm gonna throw these on the car, and we will go from there. There's no, they're not a name brand or anything. They're just, I, I don't know why anybody would pay $200 for these, cause I paid less than 100. So, yeah, but I'm gonna put these on the car and go from there. I got 3M tape and stuff. So let's get it. All right, so this is what it's gonna look like when it's on. I didn't tape it or anything. Yeah, I just placed it there. It fits like perfectly, so this is good. But it should look pretty dope. I'm gonna get to work. Alright, so I just put on the 3M tape all around, guys. If this this is really skinny 3M tape, so um, if this falls off, this video will never be uploaded. But if it doesn't fall off, then I guess this video you'll see this video. But I'm gonna I'm gonna get these put on now. I'm on the wrong side. All right, that's one. I got a perfect one too. This is this this is my first time doing something by myself on my car, and it came out perfect. There we go. All right, time to do the other side. 
Guys, when I tell you taking the 3M tape off is the biggest struggle. Damn, taking the 3 the, taking the 3M tape off is the biggest struggle. I can't talk. Taking the 3M tape off is the biggest struggle ever right now. Because it's hot as hell. But I'm doing my best here, so. Time, time for this side. Let's get it. I think the heat was definitely stressing me out a little bit, but I just got this one done. I'm about to put it on right now. And hopefully it comes out good. All right, I could possibly have messed this up just a little bit right here. I kind of like pushed it in too much and I think I, I messed it up. But um, don't worry because I still got some 3M tape left from my um, 370 from when I put the, the back of the mover on. So I'm gonna put a little bit in there and then we should be good to go. But they're both on, I, I like it, it looks dope. It looks freaking sick. All right, we're Gucci now. I got both of them on. I put a little extra 3M tape on the inside here. And um, I think it should be good, but if it doesn't stick, then I'll just pull it off and redo it. But um, it came out dope. Let me not get hit by a car. That's how it looks though, guys. Let me know what you think. Comment below what you think. All right, so I'm, it's really hot right now. I'll update you guys when I figure out what's going on next in the vlog, but for now, I'm gonna just chill and go from there. So. There's a New Jersey World album. All right, guys, so I ended up just putting on those louvers, and I'm, I'm listening to Juice World's new album right now, guys. Straight fire. If you guys know who Juice World is, you definitely got to check out his album. It's a freaking banger. It just came out, like, yesterday or two days ago. But I'm on my way right now to go pick up all of the OG merch that I still have left. I think I'm going to do a 50% off sale and just sell all of the merch that I have. So that'll be in the next video if I do that. So if you guys do want any of my merch, any of my OG merch that says Luzzy Squad in the back, you'd be a part of the Luzzy Squad. You already know. For a super cheap price, I'm going to do 50% off. And, um, yeah, I... It's gonna be lit, so I'll definitely post it on all my social media. So if you guys wanna follow them below, you can do that. Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, I'll be posting that everywhere I can. And um, yeah, we're on our way to pick those up right now, and then we'll see what else plans out for the rest of the day. As you can see, it's a new day. I changed my clothes and stuff, but I'm about to hit this car in front of me by looking at the camera. But um, we'll be. What are you doing, bro? You ain't getting in front of me. Great, that shit ain't happening. All right, so I'll catch you guys when we get um, to my uncle's house to pick up the rest of the merch. So let's get it. All right, guys, so we got all the shirts right here. There's got to be a good 200 shirts in here. Also, a bunch of posters and stuff. So I'm going to put them up on my website for 50% off. So just be on the lookout for that on all my social medias. But I'm about to head out of here right now. All right, guys, so I just grabbed gas right now. I got all the shirts in the back. And, um, you know, I've never been to Clinton Road by myself. And my uncle doesn't live too far. So um, that's this video. We're going to go to Clinton Road by myself. I am kind of scared. I'm not going to lie. I've never been to Clinton Road by myself. But, um... We're gonna head over there anyway. I gotta keep the camera low because um, I don't wanna get caught by the cops here. But yeah, we're gonna head to Clinton Road. I'll catch you guys when we start getting closer. Film a little bit on there. Hopefully nothing happens because I don't want nothing to happen when I'm by myself. Especially, let me roll the windows out because you guys probably can't hear me. But the one thing I don't want to happen when I'm there is like a tire to go flat or something. Because that's that's all bad because I have no spare tire in my car. And um, that just won't be any good. But we'll, we'll see what happens here. We're gonna head over there now. It's about a 15, 10, 15 minute drive. So I'll catch you guys when we get a little bit closer. So let's get it. All right, guys. So I'm almost there right now, and I forgot to stop it. Like the, you know, if you guys have like an OG of my Clinton Road videos, you know that I used to go to literally 7-Eleven every single video. We used to start the video off at 7-Eleven or go there throughout the video, just because it was like that was like the spot. But like, I'm almost there right now, guys. I just want to let you guys know I will have a lot of Clinton Road videos coming this summer. A lot of car videos, a lot of stuff like that, a lot of vlogs, things like that. Maybe some pranks. Definitely some pranks here and there. Um, prank videos are definitely like I want to get into more into pranks and stuff because. I mean, that's like, that's my stuff. Like, that's what I love to do. But if you guys have any ideas, please comment down below. And also, I have a lot of clear road ideas coming. I want to go in the lake with a, with a raft or something because they have the big, like, haunted lake there that I want to go in. That would be dope. They have a cliff jumping place over there. We can do a whole bunch of stuff at Clay Road, which will be a lot of fun. So just be ready for all that, guys. Content coming very soon in the summer. Just be ready. And, um, yeah, I'm almost there. I'll catch you guys when I get closer. But, um, yeah, we're, we're on a trip right now. So let's get it. I haven't been here in a while either, so I kind of miss it. I'm not going to lie. So I'm kind of, I'm happy that I'm going. I forgot how far this actually is. It was way farther drive than I thought, but we're almost there, guys. We're like a stop away. Yeah, I've made it. There's the sign right there, guys. Oh, yeah. All right. A whole bunch of bikers just passed, so that's dope. I guess now we get started, though. Um, We're on freaking Clinton Road right now by my damn self. The road, the road really hasn't started yet. This is just like the beginning of the road. There isn't really much right here. But once we really get down the road, it's gonna get a little sketchy. I'm gonna roll up the windows because um, I'm not trying to get no bugs in the car and there's a whole lot of bugs over here, but we'll see what happens here. So let's get it. Here goes that creepy house right here. They got lights now at this creepy house. Oh, they got a new door too. You guys, yeah, people do live in the house. The house is like all over rear New Jersey and stuff about some crazy people living there, but like, it's just, I, I don't know, I don't know. Definitely some scary stuff going on in that house though because Drew told me that he went, he knocked on the door one day and some crazy lady came outside and just a whole bunch of stuff, but yeah, um, 
Let's keep let's keep heading down the road here. We're doing we're doing good right now. We're still driving though. We gotta see how far we can go. I really don't feel like getting out of the car, so I'm probably not gonna do that right now. At the usual stop where we stop and then we get out and do the same thing every single time. I'm not gonna do that, I'm gonna just drive the road, see if anything happens. I guess we'll just go from there and yeah. I'm gonna get once I get to the bridge off I'll, I'll film again guys. So let's get it. There guys, so I was just thinking right now, we're almost at the bridge by the way, but I was just thinking right now, like this is probably my fourth time coming to Clinton Road with the Mustang. And this is probably my first time coming with a wrapped. I didn't even realize that. Oh crap, is there a car coming? This is super steep ass turn. But yeah guys, like this is I think my third or fourth time coming to Clinton Road with this car, which is pretty crazy. Definitely my first time coming with a wrapped. It's just hard with this car because the gas is freaking horrible. And coming all the way up here is like it's a stretch for, for my gas tank, you know? But I'm um, with the 370, we came over here freaking out almost every single night and film a video for you guys but i was just gonna stream tonight but i was like nah like i want to bang out a video for you guys so i figured you know what and i think it's a good idea if i go to clan road by myself because i don't think anybody's ever done it um not that i know of if you got if anybody's ever done it please comment down below but yeah i don't think anybody's ever done it so i figured why not get it done and um just see how it turns out but it's kind of scary i'm not gonna lie especially like i have nobody to talk to for all i know i could i could look over to the right and there'd be somebody sitting in the seat next to me and like guys there's like real stories of people like literally getting run off the road here that's why i'm kind of nervous to go by myself because I mean, like, what if it's like five people and it's just me trying to drive away? I mean, my car's pretty fast, so I'll probably get away compared to like an average car. So, well, for the best here. But I doubt anything's gonna happen. We should be fine. And um, we're about to pull up at this bridge right now. Yep, I know it. This is the bridge right here. Is anybody here? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Nope, nobody's here. That's that's usually where we park at right here. And um, yeah, it's where we're seeing like a, a ritual thingy going on back there. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. Yeah, that's really about it. This is like the bridge where you throw a coin off and then the, the kid comes or whatever. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go a little bit more down and then I guess we'll turn around and go from there. So yeah, it was definitely fun though. It's a little bit more nerve wracking when you're by yourself than when you're with your friends and you hop out the car and play hide and seek. So with no lights. But yeah, but yeah, guys, 100%. A lot of Clint Road videos coming, and especially they're about to come out with a movie. So Clint Road's gonna be freaking popping, and you already know I'm gonna drop some bangers on Clint Road for sure, 100%. So. Yeah, that's all I really got to say right now. We're just driving down the road. I just want to talk to you guys, and um, it's a perfect place to do it, right? So, yeah, we're just cruising right now. We're going to do a quick pull. All right. Next straightaway, we do it right here. We're going to do it. We'll go down a second gear and just rip it. Guys, there's like so many sharp turns and stuff here. It's kind of sketchy. Don't speed. But um, yeah, you gotta you gotta do it for the vine, for the YouTube. But, yeah, I'm about to turn around now and then we'll go from there. All right, so I got no connection back here. My music shut off, so I just been sitting here like literally just in silence, just thinking. I don't even know what's going on right now. So I turned around and I've only seen two cars since I've been out here. It's not even that lady. There's 10, 17. Usually I'll still be seeing like 10 cars at like 2 a.m. Like we used to come here all freaking night and stay till like six in the morning, which is it was lit, but. I don't know, me and Drew used to just get lit over here. This would be mad fun. But I'm on my way back right now. I'm going a little bit fast. So I think I'm going to put down the camera. And um, I'll catch you guys when we get off Clay Road. But it was definitely fun. Um, if I see anything, I'll let you guys know. But as of right now, I haven't really seen much. All right, so I'm getting lasered right now with zero cars around me or anything. There's a cross right down the tree. I don't know what the hell just happened. I just randomly started getting... Oh, and now it just shut off. Um, all right, that's, that's, that's sketchy. That's a little sketchy. My radar is really good. It, like, usually it doesn't go off for stuff like that. There's a car. Bro, this guy in front of me is a freaking Uber driver on Clinton Road. I see the sticker on his um, back windshield. I don't know if you guys can see it. But he's a freaking... I think I'm scaring him right now because I'm kind of close to him. But oh well. I was trying to go around him at first, but he's going a little bit too fast on these turns for me to go around him. So I'm going to just let him be. Oh, there's another car. That's five cars I've seen. That's still not a lot, but oh, that was a truck too. But we out. I'm almost off Clinton Road. Finally, I started getting a little bit shook when I... When the, the right when I turned off the camera, the laser went right back on, like loud as hell, and my music started playing out of nowhere and a bunch of crazy crap. So I, I got hella scared. I was trying to get the hell off the road as fast as possible, but we're almost off. And that is a cop. Uh, no, it wasn't. That was just a guy with a big ass light bar in his car. I'm right, making a quick, quick pit stop at 7-Eleven right here. This is not the 7-Eleven that we usually go to, but this one will work. And then I'm head to my house, so I'll catch you guys when I get over there. All right, guys, so I'm at my house right now. Me and Drew just put in the freaking work. We did. Signed a bunch of posters, put all the shirts up here, medium, small, everything. We got it all, guys. So be ready for that. I'm going to drop the merch later this week, so just be on the lookout for that. But, um, yeah, I guess I'm going to just get to editing this video. So I guess I'm going to end it off here. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe. Check out all my social medias 
in the description. That is it for today. I love you guys. Smash the like button. Peace out.